What is up, everybody? It is Freaker, and welcome back to Tears of the Kingdom. And yeah, uh, if you're here last time, we did the labyrinth right there. Uh, it's a little more expansive than the last game. It was in three different tiers, but we got the Evil Spirit Greaves, I think it was called, but pants, essentially. And I figured, eh, I'm just gonna warp up to the top, see if I can find the next point of interest. And I won. wanted to try to get a tower. I see the Kokiri Forest there. Or Lost Woods. Whichever it is. I think I might be uh, just over out of bounds here. If I can... Oof. Close call, because I, I think I would have... Uh, Oh, uh, was it out of bounds? Black, blackout, zone out. I forget what it's called. Void out, void out. That's what it is. Typhlo ruins. I forgot that was up this way. Okay, and if I remember right, mud I cannot walk through. Will this go pitch black? Or did they actually remove that? Because I think they wanted to keep the Zonai stuff as secret as they could. Yeah, not pitch black anymore, yay. I'm gonna go, go around to get to the tower. So yeah. This is all brand new, man. I know I played Breath of the Wild a few times, but I only went to this area once, I think. Alright. Floating boxes. This one's easy enough to get to. Yep. Okay. That's what we gotta do to fix it. Gotta fix something on the tower itself. Do I see anything broken from the outside? Pull back. Ow. Hello there. I was not expecting a construct to be up here. <laughs> All right, let's see. See if I can just land behind this guy. Oh, got rid of him. I'm about to say, hopefully, it doesn't. Break this other one. Ah, it's so close. Alright, so that's now out of the way. Pick errors, buddy. Pick errors. Uh. Person in chair. Alright. This one should be active. And... Launch! And there's a 
dragon. Didn't really want locked into that camera angle, but okay. That should be the labyrinth that we just came from there, as I'm assuming. I know there's some... I almost said Poneglyphs, but that's One Piece. The glyphs of whatever, whatever type, there's one pretty close to us. Great Hyrule Forest, there's a big chasm. There's something interesting in the sky, too. I think it was off this way. Yeah, it looks like one of the things we just fought. That's probably where the shard is. But I'll go ahead and activate this. Just because it's it at least give me a teleport spot. Oh yeah. No wonder. Alright, let's check out the the gumball machine. Yeah. <laughs> I was wondering if that would do enough damage. Let's see if there's any new stuff here. <laughs> Lights. Steering sticks, finally. Homing cart. Interesting. Shock emitter. Yep. Might as well, might as well stock up on some of these, especially the steering sticks. Those are very useful. This is only a flux construct one. So I'm assuming it probably just uh, has less health. What do you, what do you got for me? I can appear. I would have thought that would have given some like spike damage. But I guess not. <laughs> Barely worked. Okay. And how did that not hit the trigger? There we go. Ow. Alright. This it should be a blessing shrine, I think. There's our star there, so I'll get that star, I think, on the way to uh the glyph. Why do I always forget what those are called? Come on. 
is essentially right behind me. Hello, tracking. I didn't like the fact that I took off my headphones to scratch my ear real quick. So there should be a star this way. Off that way. I'm gonna go ahead and just, uh, it. Oh, I see it now. It blended in with the landscape below a little bit. Oh, I kind of need to go down anyway, so. Take that. See if I can, uh. It was somewhere over here, I think. I see it. Yes. All right. Do 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 do. What we got here? Spinning gear. So probably the recall. That's what's called. I'll say replay, but no, that didn't sound right. Take forever to go in your home. Alright. Right. Haven't been any motion put to that yet. So I was correct. I just did a horrible job of smooth motion. I think I just gotta pull this rock out. Oh, that's a Korok. Yep, here we go. Alright. So what story bits do we get? I do kind of find it freaky how all that water condenses to that. Do we get to see some of the what's it, ancestor of the champions, whatever it is? Okay. Managed to restrain him somehow. Okay, this is very late. Link, I am not sure you'll be able to stop him. Okay. <gasps> Temple of Time. Okay, so this is a flashback to what we saw at the beginning where he sends where we sent the broken master sword. Master Sword. 
Okay, so some of the pieces are starting to get put together. So Zelda got sent to the past. The master sword. So the person who looks like Zelda in the past is actually Zelda. You're telling me that Link is safe? Oh yeah. I have fee, fi, whatever it is. Find me and recover your strength. <gasps> Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were okay, sent to so us. Okay, so there's a couple flashbacks I, I missed I need to get first. Great music. I know why I am here. I'm still trying to figure that part out in real life, but hey, it's good for you. Something only I can do. We will finally stop him. <laughs> to become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. Immortal dragon. I'll be forever changed. So, pieces are clearer ish. <laughs> so, at least I know what happened to the Master's Sword. But I'm not liking the implication of those like becoming a mortal dragon, forever changed. I think that's the Lost Woods. I do kind of want to go check it out. But Zelda becoming forever changed and finally stopping Ganon. I don't know if they're trying to end the timeline here or what. Do you do anything? No, that's, that's still... Gets rid of me. I feel like the fog is a different color, though. <gasps> hmm. I may need to turn around here. if I'm being completely honest. Up this way. There's probably an NPC close to here who will tell me how to get through. I think it's the Woodland Stable. There's a chest up there. Well, if anything, we're getting a decent amount of stuff. This might be upgrade. Yeah, this one would give me four upgrades. Which would be what? nice if I would ever make it back to a village of some sort. Oh, I know what to do here.
Okay, so I think I need to have it start on there. And then go off. Yep, okay. Yeah, that was easy. I like the easy... I like the shrines that's uh, a simple to understand puzzle. Like that one was simple, you just had to think a little bit, so I like a lot of those. Alright, this should work. This who I've been looking for. Hey, it's Colton. Hmm. Oh boy. That's not creepy. These two are characters. Let's see. How many... Okay, so I found the person. Bubble gems. Satori. Okay. Bubble frogs, all right. Bubble gems. Yeah, I, I knew because I've been chasing them all over Hyrule. Okay. Here, take this. Goblin mask. <laughs> Alright, and that's not gonna work, is it? Between weird people. Yeah. And now I won't be able to immediately trade for him. Trade with him, can I? But Kilton's still mm. here. Hmm. Hmm. Terry Town. Okay, so I can go visit him in Terrytown to get a location. Interesting. And while I'm right here... <laughs> Pico Pond Cave. That! Easy enough. Because the lids. Ha 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 ha. There we go. Oh. Ah. All right. One more tower down.
be a chasm. Anything interesting in the sky that's close. Shrine. See Death Mountain there. Yeah, okay, see one of the stars. Ah, I found one that looks to have, uh, rail tracks. Where's... I know I saw, like, question marks pop up. Oh. Hopefully this is not fling itself off the rails. Oh hey, a construct. as well. Alright. What we got? Probably a lot of stuff. Because I put quite a bit of stuff in there. Yeah? Oh, new stuff? Oh, regular batteries. Is there anything else that can, uh... Nope, that's four things it gives. Alright. I think it was worth it. And before I launch myself off in the wrong direction, let's actually activate this thing. Hey, we don't even need a crystal. I just re just realized. <laughs> yeah, we'll get this. Oh, that that launcher's gotta be for the star, maybe. Water makes a way. That does not. I was about to say, that does not look like water. Okay, it's trying to teach us mechanics. That if we put water on things, the water on lava, it will turn to rock. I feel like I might need this. Okay. Eh. This has got to be able to smash this, right? Yep. Oh, more hydrants.
thing I, thing I know I need to do, do now, though. Oh, this is a fan. I get one more because we all know rock floats on top of lava. Boom. All right. So when I try to not do things stupid on that solution, it worked. Good to know. And to be completely honest, I didn't think I. It would turn to stone fast enough, but I had to try. Go to the depths. Uh, we're actually getting low on time, or long on time for this episode, so I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. And we'll pick up pretty much right in the middle of this paraglide in the next one. This has been Rinker, and let chaos reign.